Bregg's T-Scope Premier Post-Op Brace is designed to provide protected, controlled range of motion for patients recovering from knee surgery. The brace is comfortable, simple to apply, easily adjustable for a personal fit, and features a user-friendly hinge to control the range of motion of the patient's knee. The innovative BridgeTech incision pad, available as an optional accessory, provides added comfort around the incision site. When worn correctly and for the length of time prescribed by a medical professional, the brace helps post-surgery patients recover comfortably. T-Scope Premier braces will not prevent or reduce all injuries. Proper rehabilitation and activity modification are also an important part of a safe treatment program. Patients using the T-Scope Premier should consult with a medical professional regarding safe and appropriate activity levels while wearing this brace. The initial application of T-Scope Premier braces should be performed by a medical professional only. Begin by unclipping the buckles. Spread the hinge bars apart and lay the brace out flat underneath the knee. Center the knee between the hinges. Orient the brace so that the hinges are facing the correct direction and the small calf pads are towards the feet. The extension controls should face the front of the knee. Loosen friction clips on the telescoping bars if they're locked. For proper fit, slide the upper and lower telescoping hinge bars to accommodate leg length. and lock the friction clips. Make sure to push these clips all the way down until you hear a click, which will mean it is now locked. Hinge bar length indicators assist in verifying the consistent length section on the thigh and the calf. Be sure to make an identical adjustment to both uprights. Position the hinge bar on either side of the leg, centering the hinge at the knee joint. It may be difficult to see the joint when the brace is applied. You can position the brace by aligning it with the non-surgical knee. Loosely fasten the two straps closest to the knee. Start below or inferior to the knee, which is easiest to fit. Then fasten the remaining two straps. Now pull the straps tight to remove slack behind the leg. Be careful to maintain the position on the hinge bars on either side of the leg. Pull the straps tight through the buckles. Again, be careful to make sure the hinge bars are correctly positioned on either side of the leg. Now secure the strap ends. Use the hook and loop Y tabs at the strap ends to affix the straps. You may need to shorten the straps by folding them over before attaching the Y tabs or use scissors to cut to an optimal length so that the Y tabs affix to the front of the leg. Be careful not to cut the straps too short so that there is no material to affix the hook and loop. Patients experiencing any increased pain, swelling, skin irritation, or any adverse reactions when using the T-Scope Premier braces must contact a healthcare provider immediately. Only a medical professional should adjust or change range of motion hinge settings. The hinge on this brace is designed to limit and or control range of motion. It's not designed to stabilize the knee when patients are weight-bearing or take the place of a walking aid. Patients should follow their physician's advice regarding weight-bearing and always use a proper assistance device, such as crutches or a walker. To adjust extension limits, pull the tab out away from the center of the hinge and slide it to the desired settings, between negative 10 and 70 degrees of extension. Make sure the tab is secure in the correct position. 
Similar to a speedometer, there is a combination of numbers and tick marks that represent the extension and flexion settings. For example, here's 10 degrees of extension, and here's 20 degrees of extension. Flexion limit settings may be selected between negative 10 and 120 degrees, shown as the last tick mark on the scale. The hinge may be locked out by sliding the red quick lock button into the lock position at any one of the five settings. Negative 10 for hyperextension, zero for neutral position, or 10, 20, or 30 degrees of extension. The BridgeTech incision pad relieves pressure and provides added comfort around the incision site. You'll need to replace one of the existing pads when using the BridgeTech incision pad. Make sure the incision pad will be placed on the appropriate cuff so it is on the same side as the incision. To replace one of the existing pads, remove it from the cuff. The piece of double-sided hook and loop may be attached to the back of this pad or could remain on the strap. If it's on the pad, remove it and affix it to the middle of the strap that's attached to the cuff. Apply the BridgeTech incision pad to the cuff with the flat side down, making sure the tearaway sections point away from the medial or middle side of the brace. The tearaway sections will be in the proper location once the brace is applied. To bridge an incision site, remove individual tearaway sections as needed. To provide additional support and pressure relief, affix the tearaway sections of the BridgeTech incision pad to the strap that is below the knee on either side of the tibia. On this patient's leg, if the incisions were here, the tearaway sections are placed here. Should you have any further questions regarding how to apply the T-Scope Premier Brace, refer to the instructions for use or visit breg.com to learn more. After initial application, the T-Scope Premier Brace may be removed and reapplied by unclipping the buckles only. It's not necessary to release the Y tabs. An adjustment may be needed to the posterior strap length to accommodate surgical dressing removal. Hand wash the foam pads and straps with mild soap. Rinse thoroughly with fresh water and air dry. Do not place pads or straps into a mechanical dryer. If you have any questions about how to apply T-Scope Premier braces, refer to the instructions for use. Patients with questions about knee bracing should contact their healthcare provider. Extra foam pads are available from customer care at 1-800-321-0607. To make sure the brace is positioned correctly in the right direction, match up the telescoping sleeves that have the larger pads with the thigh, so they're on the top of the brace, while the telescoping sleeves that have the smaller pads match up with the calf at the bottom of the brace. For more intimate fit, the telescoping hinge bars can be contoured or bent. After contouring the bars, they may no longer telescope, so setting the length first is imperative. Be careful to avoid damaging the hinge when contouring the side bars. To help brace suspension, ensure the foam pads make as much contact with the skin as possible. This will help the pads grip the leg better. To also help with brace suspension, extend the telescoping bars to just above the malleolus or ankle joint. Hi, I'm RJ Smith. Senior Product Manager of Post-Op Bracing here at Bragg. Bragg offers two telescoping post-op braces, the original T-Scope and our newest version, the T-Scope Premier. The T-Scope Premier is based on the same innovative design as the original T-Scope, which orthopedic surgeons have trusted for years. The new T-Scope Premier offers several updated 
and new features that maximize patient comfort, ease of use, and universality. The first difference is the hinge. The Tisco Premier hinge makes it easy to adjust the range of motion settings. The setting numbers are larger and easier to read. It's this easy to adjust. The braces telescoping bars adjust to fit a wide range of patients. And the brace can accommodate both right and left leg procedures. You only have to carry one type of brace in inventory. Plus, it has an updated lever design, making adjustments easier than the original T-scope brace. One of the biggest differences is the new BridgeTech incision pad. Available as an optional accessory, this pad helps reduce pressure around the incision site. And it's adjustable for the unique anatomy of patient's legs. Just remove the sections you need for your particular patient. This pad is easily added to the brace to accommodate either leg. And finally, the Tisco Premier features softer, thicker, more breathable padding, rounded sleeves, and more flexible cuffs for better patient comfort and brace suspension. Ask your Bragg sales rep about the new Tisco Premier. You can also call Bragg at 1-800-321-0607 or visit Bragg.com to learn more.